Hello and welcome everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We are back. It has been two weeks now. Um, and if you are watching us live, you might notice a little bit of an early start time that is due to a slight change. Um, but first and foremost, welcome to Visually Impaired, the weekly show where we play visual novels because I am a complete noob and my buddy here is not. Everyone say hello to Mr. Wolf Freak. Hello. And we have a slight bit of change in time if you're joining us live, uh, and that is because Mr. Wolfie here has moved. He is now a full East Coaster. Yep. And, That's exciting. And as a result, I am not. Uh, <laughs> uh, so our time zones are three hours apart now. Uh, which we, uh, couldn't be further away from each other while being on the same in the same country. <laughs> yes. So, um, to kind of make up for it, we are going to be starting uh, from here on out. Uh, tonight was 6.30 p.m. Pacific, uh, which is 9.30 there. Uh, we will be starting at 6 p.m. Pacific um, from here on out to try and compensate, uh, which is good for me because then I get to go to bed at an early time now. <laughs> I'm going to tell. We totally could. It's an exaggeration. Uh oh, is the oh, hold on? Uh oh, wait, are you in my channel? I am. And is Nutella talking? Yes. Oh no! Too. Oh no! Hi guys, I I have, I have been as well. Unfortunately, got a BRB real quick, so will you figure that out? No, <laughs> what is going on? All right. <laughs> We're back, and we're having difficulties. Uh, apparently, my chat is not loading. Let's exit out of that. It's, uh, apparently, my chat... Whoa! Ignore that. Uh, can you see me? In chat. Well, this kind of okay. Hey, we got lead. All right. Uh, maybe I was not quite sure what happened there. Uh, yeah. All right. Cool. Someone's posting. Hey, we got it. We're back. Uh, I don't know what happened. <sighs> okay. Uh, <laughs> well, we'll hopefully be right back. Uh, yes. Last week I uh, took a took a week off simply because uh, my mom was in town and I wanted to spend some time with her before she went back to the great state of Alabama. Roll Tide. And now we're back and Wolfie was also gone so it's not like you were missing much anyways. He's the better part of the show. Um, so tonight we are looking to finish up uh, 999. There it is. And um, we're on our path to the good ending. I don't remember at all where we're at. So this is going to be a little bit of a journey. How's everyone doing tonight, by the way? Um, as I stall just a little bit longer and take a drink. Got myself a nice ginger ale. 
we finished door seven. Oh, that's right. That's right. And then there was, I think we're on the final puzzle, right? Or the final puzzle room. If I am not mistaken. As far as plot goes, I have no idea. Let's go ahead and get into the game here. Disappointed in how Wolfie answered my question earlier. And you know what's funny about that is if it had anything to do with story spoiler, totally didn't see it because my chat was not loading. <laughs> Right, okay. What's in our inventory real quick? Because, uh, we do not have an inventory, I guess. The dead is not working. Oh, so no spoilers, okay. Uh, Final Fantasy 15 soundtrack, what about it? Nautical charts. Oh, the wheelhouse. That's right. Okay. I was like, this does look familiar. Got it. I'm back. Sorry about that. No, we're good. Uh, I'm gonna sneeze. Hold on. Bless you. Hmm, thank you. Okay. Can you see chat now, sir? I can, yes. Alright. Yeah, so for whatever reason, it just didn't load up the first time I did it. Can you... See, Nutella, here's the thing, though. I don't know the entirety of the, uh... of the Final Fantasy soundtrack, so it might be. But it doesn't really seem like a sex song to me. You're gonna have to link that song in Discord. Okay. I'll look it up again. Okay. There's another room on the side of the window. Okay, so I don't really remember this puzzle. Oh. I kind of do. Like, I know we need a little uh, timepiece for that, right? Yep, uh, I think that's the last step. Mm -hmm. That shows us. It is in our personal conversation. Okay, cool. Okay. There are a number of red pins in several locations. This is the one where you like turn the wheel and adjust the speed. Yeah, that's right. Okay, so we got seven locations. Each one has a word next to it. It's probably the speed. Oh, that's right, because I'm going to need to memorize that. <laughs> File. Wait, uh, nothing to do with that. Yeah, there we go. That's what we needed. Let me get my handy dandy notepad. Like Steve from Blue's Clues. That's right. I watched that shit. Who uh who replaced Steve again? I don't remember, he sucked. It was like his brother or something like that. I forget his name. Yeah, and then it was like uh, the rampant rumor that he that Steve just died or something. You're like, yeah, you're like yeah. what? There was I think the outstanding one was that he he was in a band and that's why he left the show and then he overdosed or something like that. <laughs> Isn't it like a jazz band though? It's like you're like, whoa. Jazz has gotten really heavy. Okay, so but, uh, fun fact, not true. <laughs> yeah, no, he's fun totally fact. alive. Uh so I read he's done interviews about it. Too. Yeah. <laughs> and it's because he was like starting to bald. So he's like, I don't want to see, I don't want kids to like see me grow up. Yeah. So, he was supposed to be that age forever. Yeah. Full. Half dead stop. I 
And then this is where we find, uh, what's his name, right? Uh, Captain? Cappy? Cappy. Yeah. Cappy. I think, it, I think it's just Cap. <laughs> Whatever, he's a buddy of ours now. Yeah, he's yeah. a bro. How do I get in that room again? Go that way. Oh, there we go. Uh, oh, I need the handle for this, don't I? Yeah, I need the handle for that one. So I think you have to steer it first. Looks as though it was deliberately removed. A steering wheel, their hands placed together at intervals, so that's easy to turn old school. You have to back out from that screen. Oh. Yeah. So it would seem. By the way, we had a conversation today in my Discord. I'll be a bit kind of short. I saw some of it. I guess we were ranking waifus and duders, or what do you call guy waifus? Oh, guy I did not see that one. Time to catch up. <laughs> <laughs> um, and we were talking a little bit about, like, say, seven. Has bandos. There you go. Yes. I kind of like gaifu. Why can't that be a thing? Because it's a laifu. <laughs> Well played. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I, would, I would love to take credit in making that up, but I, I haven't. <laughs> okay. There's actually... <laughs> there's actually a mobile game called uh, Waifu or Laifu. Oh, don't know that yet. Compass... Well, I know where I know where you sit, and I know where Anya sits. I don't remember where anyone else sits. That's because no one really weighed in, because they're all on the fence. And they refuse to give any opinion whatsoever. Uh, you know where I sit. You like seven. Seven. Seven's the big dude, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm okay with him. He's not, like, I wouldn't classify him as, like, a top tier, but I'm okay with him. Ah, uh, timepiece. Oh, yeah. Back to watch hey, man. What are you doing? Oh, I just thought I'd come oh. check up on the two. Oh, this is where we yell at Ace. Can I skip? Uh, we'll be nice to him this time. No, oh, wait, hold on. Watch more dialogue. Yeah, there we go. Just kidding. <laughs> Moving along. Seven fucks. I just want to talk to Clover alone. That's why I said. I just want my sweet, sweet Clover. To to I don't want anyone to overhear us. Oh, that was the other thing. Anya was like totally down for Clover. I'm like, uh. She's the best. She's a one note character. She has like no doubt. Oh, oh, I know. <laughs> <laughs> she has two speeds. You don't know everything about Clover yet. Yeah, that is true, I don't. Oh, ho. I see, of course. I apologize for the intrusion. Well, best of luck. But even if she was, was just like a, a one-note character Why where she had the one big like moment, that? it was a pretty big moment. <laughs> oh, uh, no, 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 it's not like that. But it's erased now. What's it like then? Is it? I just wanted to hear the rest of that story. It happened. It just wasn't this timeline. I didn't get a chance to ask you about it until now. Actually, yeah, I just saw that lead. What story? I literally just saw that. The experiment, remember? 
The one you started to tell me in the operating room? The Charger's tight end. Oh. He's basically oh. supposed to be our new Antonio Gates. You said something about an experiment oh. that happened here nine years That's a lot ago. of pressure. Yeah, no kidding, right? <laughs> but they said about that about him like two years ago, and it hasn't happened, so... Talk about that right now. But he's exactly, he's like built exactly the same and he's like just as good, supposedly. Okay. Uh, Season on the AC. You understand, Got right? There. I'm just. I it's always those ACLs, about my brother. What's that? It's always those ACLs. ACL or MCL? I mean, yeah. who would do something like that? Right. To my brother. I, <sighs> I can't forgive them. I'm not gonna let them get away with it. I mean, yeah, that's that's the hard thing is like when They're you're expected to be as good as the tight end that you're promise. playing with, but so, he's still playing. So, Junpei, who do you think did it? Philip Rivers doesn't have one, well, so you can't well, be too hard to get rid right, of Michelle. Then there would have to be at least two of them. Have they have they been trading snaps or have they been on the field at the same time? Uh, they'll be on the field at the same time. He usually he's in a blocking role. That means there were at least two other people. Because our offensive line can't protect Philip Rivers worth of shit. Oh well, yeah. You're right. And Philip Rivers can't so move anymore. What does that mean? No, he's a fat fuck. <laughs> well, if we just look at the bracelet numbers. He's like a less mobile Ben Roethlisberger. Can he not walk? <laughs> well, really, who and who uh, let's just say he's not moving out of the pocket. You mean it could have been four uh, people? Ben. Well, technically, it's possible. Yeah, I shouldn't make my many Steelers jokes now. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, you're like right there now, all kind. Likely. I'm on the other side of this um, I'll tell you later. Yeah. We got more I'm more in Eagles country. We just assume but... it was only two other well, people. yeah, after they won the Super Bowl, everywhere's Eagles country. Just like how Seattle okay, fans uh, got it. started showing up out of nowhere. Yeah. Then who do you think it could be? Well there's always the bad players, but Which two bracelet numbers added to two would give a digital root of three. Digital root of three, so it's got to be... Uh, so it's whatever these two plus the number two. Wait, whatever, who, Clover, and... I'm confused. Who are we trying to add it to? Clover is trying to figure out who killed her brother. Oh yeah, and we so, we have to say seven and Santa, right? Uh, seven and Santa would be eight plus two. No, nine plus ten and plus two. Yeah, that would work. <laughs> I forgot what Santa was. Santa's yeah, three. Yeah, it's seven and Santa though. Uh, that uh isn't available. <laughs> yeah, it is. Oh, just kidding. There it is. I'm, I'm staring at it. <laughs> Would it be Santa and seven? Yeah, I never saw Ravens fans. The digital the digital Santa and seven is... Well, that's because no one wants to jump jump on the Flacco bandwagon. That giant Wait. eyebrow. Wait, hold on. Yes, fair. The was Ray Lewis still with the team in 20? Uh, he was. What's wrong? Yeah, what's he retired. Yeah, he retired shortly <laughs> after. And then oh, after no. that, the whole Ray Rice thing. <laughs> mm -hmm. Baltimore started slowly turning themselves into the new Raiders. Santa and Seth. If it was two people, yeah. it's the only combination yeah. that works. Hey, wait five to a nine. <laughs> Holy fuck! Hold Don't you think it's a little too early to be jumping to conclusions? <laughs> Whoa, now! <laughs> is, that, is that how we're describing quarterbacks? <laughs> well, all I said is that those two would have been able to open door three with your brother. There might be other possibilities. 
So are there any other no. decisions I need to worry about? Exactly one. Okay. Uh, um, are you I think it happens or four people? after this puzzle, but it might happen during this puzzle. I really don't think that's um, likely. Oh, wait. Did we already do that? Why not? Did we give Clover the clover? Can I borrow your we did. Pen and paper? But never mind. You're good. Okay, so no more yeah, decisions? Here. Nope. Lotus or Clover? Oh, no contest. Lotus. Okay, but Clover, though? What's this? These are the combinations for three or four people. These eight combinations are the only possible ones. Oh, I see. Junpei? Okay, so I don't need this I, I can trust flow chart at all anymore. So that's cool. Of course. Why would you need to ask that? No, it already happened. Sorry, yes. It's been, uh... Really? What, two weeks? Two weeks! And so I've I had other things on my mind, unfortunately. You know, moving to a whole nother state. Oh yeah, how is it out there, by the way? Of course. Just cross That's pretty nice so far. Uh, I haven't met an and unfriendly person, which is a little surprising. But... <laughs> it's the city of brotherly love, so, right? What does that yeah. Mean? That's how that works. <laughs> <laughs> hey, go fuck yourself. Wait, it can't be a. It's like the national saying of the East Coasters. Why? It's like a greeting. June's in that one. There's no way in hell she'd do something. Have you like smashed that. any girls on Tinder yet? I don't even have Tinder. I might want to get on that, sure? but <laughs> at the moment, no. I think okay. the uh, I can cross off the, uh, right? like. Sales lady at yeah. Best Buy might have been flirting well, with me today. What have we got left? Oh shit, she got money. That's like the closest thing. Do you know what this means? What the fuck is Bumble? What Everyone is Bumble? Me, you and Jimmy would be working together. <laughs> Do you think that's likely? Okay, lad. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna. I'm assuming it's a dating app, so I'm just gonna. If there were four people working you know, together. Broad strokes here. I don't have any dating apps. I don't think they try that hard to hide what they were doing if they outnumber. But the girls have to talk to you. Isn't that how like real life works? <laughs> like. <laughs> well, you do have. A Wait, do the girls have to initiate conversations? Besides, Is that what? If eight and seven are working so together, guys don't get a chance to swipe. It's all girls. They could have easily Christian, done have you fucked any Christian. bitches yet on Christian Mingle? <laughs> Plenty of fish.com. See, I'm a fan of farmers only. But they didn't. <laughs> they didn't even try anything. Have you heard that jingle? Oh, I have. If they were killers, it's, so, why would it's solid. It fits. <laughs> it's such a mean oh, one. <laughs> I see. Anyway, I understand now. It seems pretty unlikely that it was as many as three or four people. Yeah. Then that means there's a good chance it was... They have to <laughs> initiate the conversation so they are way more stuck up and have daddy issues. <laughs> I'm a broad stroke the entire female gender. <laughs> was something I wanted to speak with you about, Junpei. Could you come with me for a moment? Let's just exclude Clover from this conversation now. Go ahead. Well, have you known okay. that everyone has daddy issues, Led? Unless your daddy is ace. Hey, am I right? What did you want to talk about? I feel like he'd have more issues. <laughs> <laughs> there was something I wanted to... Because he's figured, sure. figured out time travel? Yeah? What's that? If you oh, have we figured out who Ace is? Yeah, he's what, the head of the pharmaceutical guy. That's about all we know so far. Just and that he was the one that attempted to murder no, Snake. No, 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 stop! Yep. Accurate. Because he remembered Just Snake from last time? What exactly are these pieces from the last of game or whatever? In your pocket? But he has that facial recognition thing. Yeah, where so you can't really see. <sighs> You switched them, didn't you, when blank. we voted? <laughs> don't exist. <laughs> so everyone just looks nah. like Slenderman? I can't say that Pretty I Pretty much. 
I it's managed a horrible to get through the number experience. door I wanted. I'm going off my experiences sure. between Dumb Bumble and Tinder. Maybe more bots on Tinder, but they are nicer. Then, well, Bumble has less why bots. Why did you? They're way more stuck up. Oh, in here. simple curiosity. My I best experience is comes with farmers only. <laughs> well, Led, if I can make one suggestion, is clean uh, up the neck beard. <laughs> Might help your case. Oh, <laughs> I, I'm like trying to be as sincere as possible and not sound like an asshole. I realized that oh. it didn't come off that way uh, at all. Definitely did. <laughs> they don't need to know about the neckbeard till the date. <laughs> the classic bait and switch. <laughs> Okay, I have the clock. This shape, maybe. Nothing. Oh, uh, because we have to get the watch wound. Can I examine the watch? Oh, uh, I remember how you do this. The hands uh, are yeah, have, you, uh, have you done both the both the steering and other puzzle yet? I have not. You have to do both of those before the watch even becomes a factor. Okay. It won't move. Nothing in the drawers. I think they're getting a nice clean shave, man. In actuality, they're getting a depressed homeless man. <laughs> Depressed, homeless looking man that lives in Little Rock, Arkansas. The most ghetto place in the South. Old Arkansas. Something with a compass on it. Oh, uh, nope, that's uh, bad. Don't go there. Number two most murder per capita. Let's go for one Little Rock. <laughs> Isn't one Chicago? Probably. That sounds fairly oh, yeah. accurate. Wait, hold on. Wasn't like St. Louis and Detroit up there too? Thought so. Let's be real. Most of the cities are. Uh, nautical table. Back. Didn't I get a map too? Hold on. I think that was a nautical table. The nautical table had directions on there. Did it? Oh god, I totally didn't pay attention to that at all. Okay, so South uh, I'm fucking it up. Hi Anya. How's it going? Anya Alright, so South West Southwest Northwest East North and straight. I like how <laughs> we go compass directions and just fucking head straight. Straight. Anya, how's it going? We missed you. Uh, okay, so. Uh, south. Does it matter which way I go? Oh, I just got uh, it. No, as long as you stop, like, on the thing. And I could press it before, and it, yeah, okay, cool. Yeah. I remember now. As long as you're after the line, like, before it. Yeah, so... Southwest. Per capita, the murderiest city in the U.S. is St. Louis. Northwest. Uh, east. And north. Stop. What the? What the? The handle came off. Does not look like a handle. What does it look like, Lionel? A wooden screwdriver. I'm a 
avoiding I'm, I'm avoiding the obvious joke. I mean, I give you credit. It kind of looks like I handled it, me though. <laughs> Excellent. That should allow us to operate the switch. It's good to know, lad. <laughs> that is great to know, lad. Okay, so it looks like a rounded cricket bat, so like a baseball bat. Half, slow, full, half. Huh? That's weird. Okay, so we got that. That. I seem to have missed the puzzle here. I don't know how to help you. Just clean it up. Like, I don't... <laughs> Facial hair is yeah. fine, it's just not when it looks like pubes around your chin. I can tell you personally, I'm fairly overdue for a shave. Oh, are you really? Yeah. I need to see what that looks like. <laughs> okay, so my neck's decent, but the beard's just like really full, and I wish mine like grew down properly, but it, it kind of just goes out more than anything. Really? And it kind of, yeah, it doesn't look good. <sighs> you two should both put your cameras on stream. I'm pretty sure that would kill Lionel's computer. That is very accurate. <laughs> it will <laughs> absolutely fry my PC. My PC would just have an aneurysm. <laughs> Trying to compute such simple tasks <laughs> <laughs> while streaming to two different locations. <laughs> See, I could put my camera on, actually. Uh, my camera can go on and it'll be fine. See, like, this is me. Hey guys, I know I'm a bit of a hit with grid. I have some next scruff going on. Uh, but I'm married. I could, turn, so. I, I could turn mine on and send it to you, but I don't think that's a great idea. <laughs> Lionel's computer just started running at full speed. Just thinking about Lionel running the web camera. <laughs> Runs up. Hey guys. <laughs> An arrival board. The left side is filled with words. So my camera can go onto the stream, but I'm pretty sure we would cause what's called the distortion loop. If I was to have Wolfie's camera back at him. A distortion? <laughs> uh, similar to like audio engineering, when you take a signal and loop it around into itself. Okay. Give us nude cam. Uh, yeah, that's on a different website. <laughs> Is it? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, it's not. Don't bother looking that up. Oh, now I gotta look it up. Ten seconds past three o'clock, so that's when the ship arrives at the final destination. Time the time. Guys, guys what porn site do you think Lionel's on? It's, uh, it's obviously my... F I'm not gonna... Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so... Can I... Or do I just have to insert it now? Lionel's on X hamster? J date. <laughs> J date. That's. <laughs> I like where your head's at. <laughs> Pornhub is way too classy for that man. That's fair. Ten past three. Oh, perhaps. Hey, he took my pocket watch. It's not even mine. You've been holding on to it for so long. You've grown attached. <laughs> Maritime sea law. <laughs> There's a bond between you two. Just trust me. 
I think the last is porn triads. <laughs> That's you know what? Yeah, so I'm gonna clap for that one. Or is that really a thing? I mean, Patreon allows adult content, so... This is true. Not that I know that, but this is true. Yeah, I'll openly claim to know that. That's fine. You don't live on the internet for long enough to not stumble upon something <laughs> like that. That's not... <laughs> I mean, that kind of makes sense. It seems like a very safe way to trade goods and services. If you catch my drift. Hey, Clover. I like how this is always where this channel... Like, this stream always goes in this direction. Oh, yeah. Now we can get out of this room. Oh. If I, if I, if you give me, I'll, I'll donate five dollars if you give me shaving tips. All right, donate, do it. You won't. <laughs> I will go get my razor right now. This will turn to a very different stream. <laughs> Just asserting Lino sells pictures of his butt on Patreon. I mean, <laughs> oh, hashtag sellout. Patreon doesn't allow IRL porn on its website. Yeah, you can't post it to their website. There's a very it's easy loophole around, around that. <laughs> yeah, you just offer the services on anything else, right? Yeah. <laughs> Patreon.com slash Lino's butt. <laughs> this seems to be the only route. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, I like Snapchat. Yeah. Exactly. Wow. But can't you just charge directly on Snapchat well, as well? These machines are weird. Uh, I've never seen I don't use Snapchat before. enough to give you an answer on that. Uh -huh. I don't have Snapchat. I don't. Wait, this one is. I don't think there's a. Oh, I don't is. think there's any the sort of payment tools on there. These were used to transmit Morse code a long time ago. Oh, uh, yeah, I remember this part. This must be the communication office. And that door? If you remember the code, I'm pretty sure you can skip most of the puzzle. Huh. I don't remember the code. That's what right. it says. Yeah. Then, do you think... You can pay money through Snapchat. Okay, good. Oh, yeah. I, I like use just... for Snapchat. I have like five people added, and they send me stuff. And hey, Cappy. Send them texts. Sephra. Oh, we gotta go hide that axe. Nah, you're good. You get Clover, Clover, and axe as well. You defuse the Clover. <laughs> Diffuse the clover. <laughs> Pull the green wire. Back. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't remember the it code. I do remember that the code one. is in hex, though, right? It is. Yeah, that's dumb. <laughs> well, the power's on. There's blood on the chair. Rut row. Uh, it's a nice chair. I'm gonna BRB real quick and grab some water. So. Okay. Music box. Oh, that's right. Because if we. Yeah. Use... Uh, if I remember right, I think it's in Braille or something. Table. It's a lamp. I love lamp. Mm. 
Nothing in the bed. Okay, we check. Why don't we just press one of these? Like this one. That's right. wasn't one of us, there's no way that man could be zero. That's so spooky. Uh -huh. Spooky. Don't you get it? The letters that spell zero on the TV screen, the captain's clothes he's got on, and of course, the bracelet with a zero on it. Does this ending actually explain why this guy's dead? It's too obvious. <laughs> Look, look, this is zero right here. This dead body is zero. <laughs> He's kind of got a point. Isn't that kind of fishy? You're right. Only an idiot wouldn't see through something like that. Unless he's metagaming the shit out of us. No, that, that's not the point. So I'm not trying to make fun of them for thinking a trick like this would work. It does explain. Okay. Good to know. Sorry. Welcome back. Which makes me wonder. Why'd they do it? I think this is a challenge. A challenge from the person who's really behind all of this. He's making fun of us. This hero's better game, <laughs> Don't you get it? If whoever killed this guy really wanted us to think this corpse was zero, they'd never have put a bracelet on him. Walking around with a zero bracelet would be like hanging a sign around your neck that said, I did it! You think we could, like, turn this into a one-shot? Anyone with a brain would be able to see that this guy is supposed to look like everything zero is supposed to be. I feel like this is essentially a D&D campaign. Wouldn't you agree? Minus all the, uh... Just like we did. The pseudoscience. <laughs> the killer must have known we wouldn't think he was zero and put the bracelet uh, on him anyway. Um... But I feel like you could just, you, you know, DM a game like this. Do you know why? Why? I mean, like I suppose. I said, he's mocking us. Too bad, sucker. I'm not sure this D &D would be the best format for it. Where's the real me then? See if you can catch me. But like, I guess it would work. It's the same bad joke a lot of criminals like to play. They'll just sit back and watch. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Please DM a game that requires me. <laughs> That's really twisted. You don't have the morphogenic fields it would take to DM this. True. It's really childish. It's like it's just a game to whoever this person is. That's what seems funny to me. I am done with school. There's not... You could not Maybe. pay me Let's enough to money college. to go back to college. Maybe a betrayal of House on the Hill scenario? That would make I don't more know. sense. Well, yeah, I mean, What's not D&D &D specifically. Is... I'm just kind of referencing that as like... Oh yeah, no, I got you. Yeah, the style of game. I would have told you. You have no idea. The answer is six. Why would I? Hmm. We should check and see if he's got anything on him that might tell us who he is. Give me a hand here, Clover. I like what you're implying, though. <laughs> we gotta flip him over. How else are we gonna search his pockets? Pandas. <laughs> pandas. <laughs> That's how I always remember that was pandas. I'll do it. Pandas. Pandas. Here we go. <laughs> pandas like pemdas. Huh? Hey, Eight it's touch. No, six. It's <laughs> six. Oh, wow. <laughs> Wow. 
There's two things. There's two things that play in there. That's the M and the A. <laughs> I'm, I'm pretty sure if you put parentheses around it, it's still six. If you put, put parentheses around the two plus two. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Teach me how to addition. No. You really, here's the sad thing, you guys. I'm about to have a kid, and at some point, it's going to ask me mathematical questions. No, it's just... That's <laughs> true. I guess I didn't really think about it. And I'm not prepared for that. That's the internet. Off, that means he's dead. <laughs> like, you know what, child? Well, Let me get back to you on that. I think you scrambly text Discord. <laughs> <laughs> Let's yeah, yeah. teach him addition and BDSM. Yes, you're right. It is oh. Pretty obvious. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> you're going to be the uncle we barely chemo, see. You know? <laughs> Barely I mean, a, if there wasn't all this blood, he almost looked like he was still alive. Get ready for the new version of math. That may, wait, hold on. There's a I new version of, of math. Thing to say, but he kinda has it yeah, before, you know, kind of our math is weird now. Dying from a bomb going off inside of you. It's basically it's formalizing just... the uh, the mental tricks a lot of us use. Some of Snake's bones went right through his skin. I, I think the explosion must have thrown him against about a wall weed or stuff something. And subtraction. Hey. 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 There was a broken bone just sticking out stuff. of his left arm. Chris can be my uh, and, uh, liaison into the furry world, I guess. What did you just say? Man, uh, I am. I. I am so sorry. I I shouldn't yeah. have said that. I Chris might be your I really best bet. I don't know what I was thinking. I mean, he's less like, uh, less likely to make no, things weird. No, that's not what I'm talking about. <laughs> what did you say about his arm? A uh, arm? Yes, his left arm. You said it, didn't you? Are well, we? Yeah, I did, but. I mean, I are we dating Clover? Yes. Of course not. I could barely look at him. There's no way I was going to see the details. So wait, doing this scene before, sure we didn't go over this line of dialogue. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty so sure So we was. know this now because going through the last ending. And he had a broken mm -hmm. bone, right? Mm-hmm. Oh no. What the hell are you, you getting at this here? regardless of what route you took? Oh, can I just Just shut up and answer me! What the fuck? You, yeah, you, he did. Okay. Yeah, it was yeah you would get this regardless of which ending out you did of the first, arm. I guess is a better way of saying it. <laughs> so because you are in the route that you're in, and because you made What's the decisions wrong? that you made, the scene is happening. Look, I'm sorry. But we didn't get anything. this line of dialogue. Last time we were in this room. Thank you. Oh, last time we were here. That's true. Huh? Because you made different what, decisions. What are you? Ah. Thank you so much, Junpei. Okay, so now she realizes that her brother's not dead. Mm -hmm. Oh, shoot. Hey, hey you uh, have what's going on? Uh, successfully diffused the clover. I'm sorry. It's just, I'm so happy. Why? Because you made the decisions you made, Clover's gonna murder the his, shit out of you. <laughs> oh, okay, so I thought, okay, I thought this line of dialogue was like us already knowing on earth would you think that that wasn't Snake. No, we just figured that out. So we don't know anything that's happened in prior timelines then. really shouldn't be talking about this. I'm gonna say yes for now, but that's not exactly true. He's still alive. I'm, I'm so <laughs> Clover romance I route unlocked. I'm so glad. Uh -huh. Guys, yes, I can't, I can't fully right. explain what you know and what you don't huh? know from previous timelines, no but happens, at the moment, consider it hope. like a first playthrough. You None of the other timelines exist. Okay. And that's to have faith and to have love. 
Damn, Clover, yeah, no kidding. Clover's just like all Sailor Mooning up in here. Uh, that's. I only made it here because you gave me this. I was suspicious of everybody. Guys, she's like twelve. Calm down. I don't know if she's legal or not. <laughs> Can't say for sure. I think she is. Yeah, I gotta look it up. Thank you so much, Junpei. Oh, if you How really want to thank Mexico somebody, you, you should be thanking Santa. I can't hear it. Oh. Uh, usual loud. Why? Okay. Uh, well, you, well he take. was the one who gave me that thing. Oh, is she 18? Really? She's 18. And okay. For each I don't have to look at it. I got that from him, too. Do they ever say that at any point during this game? Because I always assumed that she was, like, 12. No, she's, uh... She, Aren't we 18? I thought she was in her... Uh -huh. Mid to late teens. Mm. It's not really clear. The fact that she's the little sister of another character makes her seem a whole lot younger than she is. Along with the outfit. What did, is she doing? Did Santa really tell you those she's things? She's looking around. Oh. Or studying you. Yeah, I he don't know. did. Did I uh, say something wrong? Oh no, not at all. In fact, this could be really good news, I think. You think? Santa knew about the words Today and Today is clothing. International Goth Day, and man, have goths changed since high school? The only people who should know about that are the other subjects. I want to ask, but I also don't want to ask. Yeah. Subjects? The other people who I'm were good. in the experiment nine years ago. I'm good. With my brother and <laughs> Just don't. <laughs> But he's blind. And I was part of the Nevada test oh. run. News on my front. Um, so neither of us would be able to recognize thank the you to faces Chris of the for people securing who the were internet on this boat. In this mm -hmm. uh, it's pretty kick-ass. <laughs> hmm. like whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, time college. out. Nice. Let's just calm down for a second. So okay. streams on my end are likely going to be 720p now. Hype. Don't start with the end and then jump to the middle. Uh, we have a hundred up and down. You gotta start with one nice. and then move to yeah, two that's and solid. three and four and so mm -hmm. on. It's been pretty consistent all day. We don't have if you don't a tell LAN stuff in connection. The right order, I'm never gonna be able to figure it out. Currently, uh -huh. we'd have to run cables, which is fun. But okay. through the uh, through the five all gigahertz right. Wi-Fi, start with this experiment. It's been pretty consistently. They what happened or if not close to it all day. Nice. Okay. Do you know about morphogenetic fields? Oh Christ, really? Are we doing this right now? Morphogenetic fields. Do you know about morphogenetic fields? Alright, how about this? Can I please tell me? Theory of the telepathic. Son of a bitch. No, you have to you have to I watch you have to read about. the morphogenic fields. <laughs> <laughs> you have to live them like that. <laughs> Telepathy. <laughs> well, that's not really also, it, up, Zolo? I suppose it's similar. Zolo. <laughs> so they were testing telepathy on this ship? Yeah, I guess so. So, what exactly did they have you guys do? The same thing that we're doing now. Exactly the same thing. Try to take over the world. What? <laughs> The nonary game. Nine people were put on this. The board, exact same puzzles, but I didn't want to help. And the game started. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> you heard the good word of our Lord and Father morph Look, morphogenetic sorry, fields. I, I don't get it. What do the nonary game and some oh, telepathy God. experiment have to do with each other? It's okay. Morphogenetic field theory is actually. Am I missing something here? Super interesting <laughs> to me. The ability to it's total pseudoscience, and none of it exists. But the theory is super cool. Is it like the Tesseract in theory? It's like really cool. And the other. In practice, it will never happen. I don't know. The 
answer. You know how sometimes what? when you're up against a really tough problem, uh, and then the answer just kind of pops in your head? I've heard the name before, but that's about it. <laughs> it's a it's a 3D that's shape that mathematically everything makes sense about it, can be transmitted with but to produce it physically can never exist. Oh. When you add danger to the equation, mosquito. then it gets easier to transmit oh, that information you, over to Oh, summer child. I am confused. <laughs> it's also something in the Marvel the Cinematic Universe. Uh, yeah, that's probably where, probably where I've heard of it. I think it was like Captain America or some shit. Yeah. Was it in Transformers? It couldn't be just any old danger. I don't. I haven't watched <laughs> any of those movies. Life and death. And and. A tesseract is just a four cube. Did like a four by four Rubik's cube. Let's go. It's like a cube a within a cube that connects. I was it's in also fire. in a wrinkle. In I never met her, but I did hear her name. I've heard of it at some point. Her name is... What's up, Ace? Oh, my apologies. I seem to have disturbed you. <clears throat> so Ace. Clover was in the last experiment, you too. You two must have strong stomachs. Yes. Yes, she was. That was my takeaway. I can't imagine how you could stay in this room for so long. Clover did this In before, way, uh, once Jim nine Kane, years ago. Would you be so kind as to come and help me with something? I'm having a little trouble, and I could really use your assistance. Uh, come on, it'll only take a moment. Step away from the child. I don't want us to hear us. We can talk about this later. Clover's not a child. So Clover knows Ace then. Huh? Hey, wait. Am I getting that right? Junpei, what are you doing in there? Hurry up. I can't answer that. <sighs> Ace wants to fuck. That's a surprisingly loaded question. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's a model of a steam train. Wrong. It is a monkey with glasses. Ace wants to fuck. With like four C's. Get it right. Ace explained his side, maybe? But we have not learned of Clover's side of that question. I think that's revealed at the end. Or damn close to it. Or maybe in the library. I can't remember. Hmm. It's like a piece of paper. It's red. Um, <clears throat> I 
<clears throat> oh! Nope, I remember now. Item. Do we combine the... Nope. Uh, ink. That with the ink. Combine that with the paper. Oh, yeah. We got it. There's something on the cover. A L L I C E. Project Alice. All ice. Alice. Does this mean? What the hell is this? Hieroglyphs. Oh, that's right. I remember this part too. A form of writing used in ancient Egypt. Ancient Egypt. That's right. Can you read them? Of course. I can't. What would make you think I could? Because you're old as fuck. What the hell? Whoa, the, the whole thing's like that. Wolfie, are you still What's alive? This? I am. A, a key card. <laughs> Uranus. That's the Uranus symbol. What's going on? I don't know. Something's written on the bottom. Hieroglyphs and Uranus. Bottom uh, okay. deck library. This must be the key to the library, then. So it would seem. Bottom deck library. So oh. this is the final puzzle room, right? Seven said Negative. Like. Fuck. It would be if we weren't on true ending. Alice, Alice sleeps in a small uh, True ending has the knowledge beneath the navel of the gigantic. Yeah. Two more. Could beneath the navel Plus a couple miscellaneous puzzles. And the forest of okay. I think all in all, if you count puzzle rooms as one room and one puzzle, I think you're looking at like four puzzles. That's a lot. What's wrong? Something on your mind? Yeah, we're probably not finishing this today. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I just remembered something. Is that so? What about? Well, don't laugh, okay? The Egyptian priestess and Ice Nine. Oh, no. Interesting. <laughs> we're doing and this. And the woman what? Like, uh, I can't. Disaster? I can't take all these different sciences. They called her all ice. Okay, so there should be a fanfic about aces in the key card to start with you. And she was purchased by an English millionaire who called himself I mean, Lord Gordain. So, according to Seven, well, I, know. This I don't know if you realize there's really only two Alice. pseudosciences here. There's this theory about ice nine and uh, molecules on the library each other. on the bottom deck and there's morphogenic field theory yeah well, I, I mean it it's too much for my small non-scientific mind Junpei, have you ever heard of the term cas cas she's it's dead don't worry about it cells alive system she it died early on technology for freezing and preserving organic matter the Egyptian princess? Is that who you're talking Put about? I believe he's referring to the Egyptian princess. Freeze things without the formation yeah, of ice crystals. Died before any of this happened. <laughs> Normally, 
In and theory, she was wrench. dead Water when within the Titanic expands as it crystallizes, damaging the cell membrane. So you're saying she's single? Yeah. Yeah, go for it. Cass, however, works differently. See, okay. Let me explain to you and then that I took the easiest science courses no time to form. my entire school life. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> it took, was originally developed for the I took physical science as an alternative to the normal freezing process. And geography. That's cool. Just now think, uh, there are rumors you know, it's a lot of things, right? For other it's the ability to speak with the mind. Yep. Uh, think morphogenic field things. theory is telepathy. And well, there are obvious think, medical uses, but perhaps also uh, space travel. Ice 9 as... Space travel? Are you serious? I don't know. Surely you've heard of I suspended guess just animation. molecules being rows and all doing the same thing. <laughs> it's a Whoa really now. common idea in science fiction books and films. Like, one of them's like, hey, we're just going to change our freezing People temperature. Are Every single one of the world is like, yeah, that sounds good. I'll join in. Space. <laughs> That's basically what I, Ice whoa, Nine's going to do. Cool, okay. everyone get in the pool. It's nice and warm. Are you saying that Alice was frozen and, uh, using that cast thing? Oh, there was another Well, one. I'm sure the possibility like the, is quite like low. It is a possibility. So Ace is into ice play is what I'm getting out of this conversation. He likes oh, absolutely. Ice. Ice. He likes ice, ice baths after a good run. Oh, that's and so good, though. I did it once. Sort of I will never do it again. Instantaneous. <sighs> so good. It was the worst feeling in my you life. You think she could be alive? I did that after leg like, day. And well, I can't say for sure, of course. When I actually worked out. <laughs> I'm only Ooh. talking about possibilities. Wolfie had small. <laughs> the melting point for ice now is ninety six degrees, fits. right? I guess. True. I didn't, she were put I didn't somewhere build, where she could reach that temperature. But I wasn't as chubby as I am. <laughs> Wanna try an ice bath? That's it sucks really initially. Saying she could have it been sucks forever. Bad. Don't let him lie to you. <laughs> Just, uh, don't super fill it with ice, because you can burn yourself that way. Yes. But if she had, then we would I got, have like, an explanation for the man we found sick. On the I wanted to, like, throw up. It was so cold. Oh, you mean the guy dressed like a captain? If anything, ease yourself into it with just, like, a really cold yes. water bath. And then, it was if that down. doesn't Dude. help your muscles by itself... But then was add ice, then but add ice slowly. You don't want to add. It couldn't have been too one much. of us. That would be impossible. Paul's Wolfie's arm. Oh, hey, Paul. In order to enter the How's it going? Quarters, Paulo. Oh no, other Paul. Paul. When are we? We're on true route, and we just us finished the number one door. I don't know where we are in the puzzle. Who was it that opened we're that not door? And where are we? Santa and Lotus. No, right. we're not. We're in the number one door. Clearly, the two of them could not have opened door one, or any other door for that matter. We defuse Clover. Uh, Who else um, then could have done We're talking so. about Ice Nine now. I've lost complete, complete track of the game. Yeah. <laughs> it says words like morphogenetic, and I just kind of zone. Like, I'm pretty sure that would be me in this situation, IRL, like... <laughs> would you just zone, or would you be like, guys, we don't fucking have time for this? I think, like, it depends on how determined they are to get this crap out of their mouth, like... I'm pretty sure they'd be like, yes, I know, but hold on, we gotta talk about this. And then I would just have, like, that glossed look, that glazed look. Uh, Would you be like, hey, we should talk while we continue doing the puzzle? <laughs> yeah, can we, like, talk and move? It's kind of how I feel at work sometimes. <laughs> I know we are both gay, named Paul. We aren't the same person. That's why I said other Paul. No human being could have run to the captain's quarters, killed that guy, and run back that fast. 
There's, there's Paul 1 and Paul 2. And Paul and Hardy has the two in his name, so... It like I'm less important? No! That's why I didn't specify a one or two, I just said other Paul. That being you both, you can be equal. <laughs> well, I mean... <laughs> no, you have one door and you have the other door. You have, okay, hold on, that was bad. You have a door and then you have another door. like that would know the ship well. They would know the locations of all the hidden passages and secret doors. I was going to blurt out a city name, but I don't know if it's right. Which the city? Door Let's see if you get it. To someone like this. Sacramento? Oh, ding. Got it. It awesome. would be a simple yeah. way for them to enter the captain's quarters. Then you're saying... That's fucking middle school coming back. <laughs> well... It's okay, I don't know the capital of Wisconsin. I know. Yeah, I know. I fi I just figured it was Green Bay, but <laughs> you know what? Living there, you would think it's Green Bay. <laughs> like that's the only thing I know about Wisconsin is cheese and the Packers. That's pretty much. That's pretty much it. And excessive amounts of beer. Oh, uh, you've never been to San Diego, my friend. Oh, my friend. <laughs> I, uh, I still think we got you beat. I'll come back to this later. I want to find the graphic of the, uh, the guys who... Will be when you visit me in Sacramento, like four years minimum. Wolfie has just spent all his money. <laughs> Fucking flat broke. <laughs> I spent all my money getting farther away from you guys. Good call. <laughs> Not entirely by choice, but. Okay, so we put the key in there. Oh, and then we have to look at that stupid long piece of paper that had all the numbers and hex and junk on it. Uh, there are eight of them. That probably means we've got to put in eight digits. Okay, menu, file. Nope, that's wrong. There we go. Uh... As a hexadecimal, therefore B is 12. So I need to find the one that has eight numbers then? Is that what it was telling me? Uh, what are we the code for the door. Oh, one. it's zero and X. Oh, uh, that's right. So the Z is 26 plus 9, and what we'll got from there? Wait, what? Yeah, because it's 1 through 9, and then A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, all the way to Z. Oh, 30, uh, 20, uh, 35, oh, yeah, my pen's running out of ink. Z, E, Why couldn't they have a hex calculator too? If you know the number that the letter is, you just add nine to it. <laughs> You're gonna make me sing the ABCs right now. <laughs> e is five. I don't know R or no. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm not gonna sing the ABCs so. though. <laughs> Between 1 and 26. We're gonna easy mode this. Oh, Google doesn't just have like an auto. 
R is 18. O is 15. Thank you, Nutella. Thank you, Nutella. Plus, plus nine on all those. Celebratory jump. Isn't Clover the best? Ace so is much better. Motion. Oh, and then we just do that door. Ah, you found it. Let's go. Wolfie X A's. Sorry? Uh, no, I don't like Ace. I, I'm the Ace fan. And I use that word specifically. A fan of Ace. He's an Ace, it's okay. A note. <sighs> A note? Yeah, I found it in the pocket of the guy with the captain's clothes. He, she has the bracelet, don't listen to her! It said something about the darkness of the sinister hand or something. What the hell? Uh, let me see it. Uh, no, not right. Hey, Junpei, Clover, what are you two doing? Hurry up. He's getting mad. I'll show it to you later, all right? Come on, we gotta hurry. I saw Clover's pockets and thought, "Why don't fuck that?" <laughs> you don't fucked up. <laughs> From the look of that pocket, said an I mean, axe in your pocket. Are you happy to see me? It doesn't particularly. I mean, look I'd like, like to see that note. ending again. <laughs> Jeez. Clover is acting super suspicious. She's gonna be. We did everything Fine right, but Clover still acts suspicious because the game wants you to think that you might have fucked something up. Which is really mean if you're not like following a guide or something, because then you're like, uh, uh we're so doing the same thing yeah. over again. Just like it says on the map. Ace, did he head down? Oh, there he is. Oh, the axe. Uh, Look, the, the axe is there too. behind her back or something, like tucked into really? her jacket. Let's join them. Couldn't skip in the old days. Yeah, that is also true. Clover. Mm. Hey, What's it's up? June. She's not dead we yet. We found it. Found what? We found it. What did you? There find? is an indication if you're going the last door. down the true ending. We found door nine. Like there's an indication that you're going the right way. What? Built into the game. And since we've passed what? all the major just story checkpoints, I'll just tell you what it is. Remember how okay. June sometimes has a fever? Well, yes. If that's the case. If she has a fever, you're going the wrong way. Wait for me. Interesting. Going as well. I mean, that makes sense, but Jumpy. not like you would pick up on that, I we guess. Finally made it's it. pretty subtle, yeah. uh, except for the parts where it's not. <laughs> We've reached the end. <laughs> there is... Oh, which, which ending is that? Oh, uh, when you get... When you get safe ending, she yeah. like dies from the fever. Yeah. Or she she disappears from the fever. Um, like the end of uh. That means that. Not gonna say it. Never mind. Hold on. Two of us have to stay. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> that's your main. That's your main clue. That like. Two people. That's your main clue. That's. The fever is related to the choices you make somehow. No time to wonder about it now. Yeah, that's weird, but that's hey, kind of cool, I guess. It just. Yeah. What the hell are you two doing? It's such a subtle thing that I don't think I would have ever picked up on it. You'd have to play Let's the game go, quite a bit to notice the pattern. Yeah. 
I'm assuming all endings, she's but this early. one has it at some point then. Yeah, she has Shiver's early in the game, but once you make a door choice, it depends on what that door choice is, whether or not she has a fever. Mm. I know I told you I'd explain it earlier, but... So in this, in what we're doing right now, she would have had a fever before we made the first door choice, and then never again. After we split off from you guys, the four of us got into the elevator on the left, and took us to the other side of the grate. That. Seven is so boring. His voice is boring. His face is boring. His backstory is boring. He's a cop. With amnesia. With plot convenient amnesia. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I always hate amnesia as a plot device. It's, uh, it's overplayed. Starts for sure. So, on your way, you found the elevator. That's right. So, in other words, you kind of did a lap, huh? <laughs> His body is not for it. <laughs> you came from that side to this side. <laughs> the cap of pride on that is just too good. Over here. Follow me. <laughs> Depends on the character. I feel like there should be a character out there that has amnesia and just never remembers over again. And then you just spend the entire time going like, huh, uh, uh, is it gonna, uh, well, I mean, essentially, that's like the. That's that's the main character in what Fifty First Dates or whatever it's called. They could have just left me behind. The Adam Sandler movie. Yeah. I'm a little disappointed, but they didn't. Like I saw it too. Everything I can to forget about. Well, you don't have amnesia, my friend. That's memento. Oh, uh, yeah, that's also a good one. And then you got on the elevator. But no, then he remembers. He remembers at the end that he's a fuck up. That's right. Well, I wouldn't have called that one. That Santa would be the one to stick up for you. I played I one game where the main character has amnesia, and the whole goal is to we recover your memories, but if you Santa make all the wrong choices, you just never do. That's, okay, that's pretty cool. Is that so? Uh, I guess, yeah, that's also part of, uh, Heavy Rain, too. So, is this... Do you have amnesia in Heavy Rain? Yeah. Uh, the dad no does. Place for us to go. Because he doesn't remember, like, Nope. Certain thing, like he blacks out a lot. There's I guess. Big old iron wall oh yeah, the blackouts. But like you, there's the certain decisions you can make throughout the plot, the entire story to never remember. Uh, things. I see. All right, let's get moving. Is he incapable of remembering? I thought like. Uh, it's been years since I've watched that. <sighs> No way. <laughs> but Lo where's Lotus? Where's Waifu at? The Nine Door. We're finally here. Who cares about Lotus? We don't need her. No doubt about it. This is Door Nine. <laughs> oh, finally. Okay, this is the last. On. I can't skip. This is killing me. <laughs> Shinpei, look behind you. What? Why? A door and a nine. There's another one? Hey, what the hell? What the hell is going on here?
there's a red there too. That means. Looks like I have a few weeks to go open. here before I have to come up with another game recommendation. <laughs> Why? Why After this one? Two doors? Yeah. Well, I mean, there's already one in the works. One is the right door. The well, I know that one. one, but that's that's a one-off, right? Yeah, it's gonna be like a one-day stream. Mm. I don't know about that. So I'll have to have it's something ready for the following week. What makes you say so? Well, think about all the rooms we've been through so far. Oh, Lotus is here. Sweet. Okay, we can continue. Everything's better. There are always hints about how to solve them. The one-dimensional boob character is here. Yeah, I mean, it's the whole reason why you. I'm sure, there aren't any rooms where we I'm just still have to go best guess and leave it to instinct. Does I know not like the series? I mean, to be fair, it has a lot of math and science in it. And I'm not good at either. Lano does already own VLR. VLR would be a decent option if. What's VLR? That's uh, the next game in this series. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that is an option. TR2 is an option. Or I could roll the dice with a different series. I don't think there's a hint anywhere in here. Yeah, VLR doesn't have maps. It has very well when I was in here I'm good with colors. It has science, though. Uh, okay. <laughs> like, all the games have seen those signs. Right. Yeah, that makes sense. Well, then. That kind of was built around. VLR is in yeah. particular, Both of these I think, cool. personally, doesn't make any fucking sense, but it doesn't <laughs> subtract from the game that much. <laughs> Zero never actually said there was only it's one. It's a more minor part of it. Got it. Besides the parts where it's not. It is hidden, but an exit can be found. I like how they put Seek the two nine doors Seek next door to each other. That's kind of a dick nine. move. <laughs> so if there are not two number nine doors that isn't introduced in this game, except for that one thing right. that gets referenced it's as not like. Gonna work. Oh, I don't want to spoil anything. Game, right? It's Can referenced uh, heavily throughout the game, and yeah, it's yeah. one of the last things that two of the characters say, and it doesn't explain anything, and then we never hear from those characters again. <laughs> you get it? The numbers on the top are all the combinations with digital roots of nine. The numbers on the bottom are the people There's only eight possibilities if we split up into two groups of three or four people. So... So wait, are we... people go through the door, and four are left behind. If four go through, then three are left behind, right? Yeah. Away. Paul, we'll have to get into a conversation about that if that's oh, how you actually feel. <laughs> but if we find, okay, so if we find Snake, though, then everything's fine and we can all go through the doors. What is this room? It yeah, we just like have to find Snake. Some kind of ceremony. Where's Snake, Lana? He's in the coffin. How do we open the coffin? I forgot. <laughs> good because Junpei did too. <laughs> Coffin? Oh no fucking way. Hold on. Is the could possibly be. Hold on. Is this about okay, to become a big up. pile of bullshit? I, I figured if we sat around here long enough, someone would volunteer. But I guess nobody's got the guts to do it. I don't want to say it yet. What are you talking about? What? You guys didn't figure it out yet? <sighs> fine, fine. Let me enlighten you. 
to visual well, novels, so yes. right with her little explanation earlier, but she missed something. Nutella, to answer the question you just messaged me, I don't know. <laughs> she wasn't really wrong, she just... Ah, screw it! Let me just write it out. I don't want to type a whole lot on the stream. So, <laughs> if I can answer vaguely, I'm just going to answer vaguely. If you're trying to leave with a group of three and a group of four and get everybody out, Clover's right. Oh, cool. There's another way. Seven sacrificing himself. I'm, in, I'm on board. If you split us up into groups of three, three, and one, you can make this combination. Wait, this means... Don't get me wrong here. I'm not trying to copy Ace or anything like that. Even if he hadn't been the hero back in the big hospital room, I'd still be saying the same thing. The same thing? Are you saying... Yeah, I am. I'll stay behind. Uh... That's cool. See you, Seven. Why are you acting so <laughs> heroic all of a sudden? So mean. <laughs> are you some kind of yeah, idiot? Thanks, dude. We're just gonna leave you here to die now. No, I am completely against this. I'll be goddamned if I'm gonna have to owe you for getting out of here. No, Lotus, just take the ball and run. Let's go. Stop pitching. I'm against it too. I didn't want to leave Ace behind, and I don't want to leave you either. Did I not learn about seven? Yes. We did, uh, all the southern. I don't like that idea. Mm -hmm. There's got to be other options. Although I never I found out well. what exactly happened. Can't say oh, wait, no, there was like some kids and then they died or some shit. I think it's explained well, there again, go, but the yeah, there were some kids that got Clover's kidnapped right. and There's gotta be a better Seven way tried to this. go after them, and they got, like, doesn't make any got sense. Got. Whoa, hold on a minute. I haven't said anything I yet. I'm not explaining this well. <laughs> <laughs> Are you agreeing? You want to leave him here? I mean, to be fair... Nah, I'm on I'm like five it. hours of sleep. I don't want to leave seven here and alone. I woke up at like six this morning, and it's eleven now. Then I don't see how it matters. That's cool. I've been up since three. I said alone. <laughs> huh? Yeah. I'll give me that. I said I don't want to leave seven alone. That's right. I had a girl there nine years ago. Who are you? <laughs> what? You don't get it? I can't leave just one person. I need two more. Three people, yeah, including that seven. Factor. I'll be leaving behind three people. That's my proposal. The girl that they couldn't uh, identify. Are my orders. What do you mean, orders? What the hell makes you think you can order us around? Who the hell's gonna listen to you? You all will. In three seconds, you won't have a choice. A pretty minor plot point, what? really. Three, two, Three, one. Two, one. Ah! Ah. See? I told you. Huh? What? Ooh, Why? This time. I'm into this. this. The gun. I'm into this. I like it. The guns from the other room. What room? One of the rooms behind Does that your matter six. right now? Does that matter right now, Jane Fett? <laughs> <laughs> I should have taken the gun. <laughs> well, it's too late now, fat ass. Paul, after uh, after true ending is over, we're gonna have a Q and A as well as a like general. Here's what you might have missed, now, type of thing. Time for you to start following my orders. Ace, Lotus, congratulations! I thought Santa was supposed Chosen to be nice or something. Come with me. I mean, he makes a list, so he can do whatever he wants. Put your hands in the red. Hey, you deaf? I gave you an order. 
<laughs> as long as he checks the list twice, Fine. he's all good. Fine. I didn't want to waste any bullets, but you guys just don't get it. Okay, so here's what I don't get about what's going on right now. He was already given a pass to leave. And then he's just gonna, like, go fucking rogue and fuck the group over. What? You knew about the leaf words and the four-leaf clover. What the hell is that shit? I've got no idea. Like, we were already gonna go out the door. Shut up! Just shut up, you stupid bitch! And now, you all of a sudden, he's like... Fucking head? Uh, I don't get it. Okay, continue. <laughs> Alright, assholes. What are you still standing there for? Get over here and scan those bracelets. I don't have all day. Oh, what's the matter? Your hearing's starting to go? Going senile, maybe? Yeah, I really don't get this. Who was he asking for? Uh, Ace and Lotus. Pardon? So it's you and Seven it. left behind? And Clover. And Clover. Please, go. Huh? No way. Jumpy, what are you saying? Jumpy. If you stay here, you're going to be stuck, Jumpy. So you digital root of three, if you manage to find the snake, I that's know. digital root of... But you don't need to worry about us. Yeah, so the There's piece of paper that Clover showed us with all the, you know, different combinations, literally right. the three that get left behind make, uh, uh right. what is it, 16? Like, it doesn't matter what combination of three. It's gonna piss me off to do what Santa says, but... So, like, no, ma no matter, so long as we found snake, both, everyone that. could leave. Oh, that's fine. Yeah. There's still something I, I have to do. I forgot about here. you. <laughs> Wait, what? I'm doing no, the math, I no, forgot that you were number can't. five. Yeah. Ace, Lotus, yeah. don't come over! Don't worry about me, please! Please. So yeah, you just need to find, uh... <laughs> Go. Just need to find Snake. Oh, all right. Fine. But like at this or point, is, how much time has passed? Right. Now let's get those hands oh, so much time. Panel. Like months. <laughs> <laughs> like almost four okay. months. What? You think I'm fucking around here? I don't give a shit about this. Damn, girl. Santa just went R-rated with his language. Red doesn't need a person, you know. All I need is the bracelet. Which is kind of weird. Good. Now put your fucking hands on the scanner. I'm not gonna say. That's another thing I don't get. Okay, so in the case of Clover right. using the zero bracelet, um, yeah. or whoever using the zero bracelet Good or whatever, <clears throat> I thought the bracelet deactivates once it's the opens, off the body, or once the body's dead. Uh, it releases it, once the body's you know dead. What happens. But then how can it keep working if it's not connected to the body anymore? Because it's a watch. I guess what I'm trying to say is like, so like, the bomb deactivates, right? Go. Yes, like the trigger mechanism is no longer effective. And the bracelet automatically detaches from the wrist. But it's once still active. Once their heartbeat hits zero. Zero. Uh -huh. All other factors involving the bracelet are still operational. Okay. Couldn't remember if they expressed that or not. I don't know if they explicitly do, but that's how it works. <laughs> <laughs> no, I get that we use the bracelet, but at the same time, I'm like... So... Wondering why exactly that the bracelet still works. What do you mean, what do I want to do? What can we do? Well, let's all fab. What the 
hell is that? Oh, convenience. Shh, quiet. Yeah, uh, we did safe ending, so we There's learned about AIDS. I learned a little about AIDS. Could it be? Uh, hey, I think it's coming from this coffin. You're right. Let's open it. But how? What are those muscles for? For show? There to get the to chicks. Just shut up and try. Yes, Paul, and we did learn about that. God. Damn it. Man, it won't even budge. <sighs> Not another one. Yeah, looks like it. What's the code, Lino? Do you think we have to put in the right password or it won't open? Um. I think so. Whoever or whatever's inside this thing wants yeah, I don't know. And now. Oh. Of everything that happened two weeks ago. But how? I remember, I remember saying, I, I don't think there's much thing we can do. you. Write down this code. <laughs> it's important. Isn't there a hint somewhere? <laughs> well, let's look for one. Looking through my notes. Hold on. And I don't believe the game gives us <laughs> Are you serious? There's nothing here. I can't remember. Not making this easy. The code is 80085. <laughs> nice. Don't think I have it written down. We'll see if it gives it to you. Unless it's this like long ass code How that I have I on the front out? page. What is it? I need something. I feel like this is way too many numbers, but. One four three eight three four two one. That sounds like it. Truth had gone, truth had gone, truth had gone. And now truth is asleep in the darkness of the sinister hand. Wait, what? What the hell was that? That voice. <clears throat> so remember how I said that Junpei didn't remember anything What's from that? any of the other timelines? Mm -hmm. huh? This is the exception. Oh, um, <clears throat> uh, nothing. Because you, you've you never heard that up until this point. Oh, shit. Oh! I remember this puzzle. I don't remember the answer to it. Hold on. <laughs> don't think I wrote down the answer. Good job of earning the coffin ending, Lino. Is there a coffin ending? Yeah. If, uh... Oh, God. If we haven't done safe ending and got to this point, we would have gotten coffin ending. Which is... Basically, when I did that pan over of the coffin, it would have ended about there. Really? Yeah. And does it give you, like, the hint to, uh... Ah! Uh, Truth is gone. I don't think I ever got it. I don't remember. I think it's right, left, right, left. Right, left. One, four, three, eight, three, four, hey, it does two, give it to you. one. Huh? But you need to remember the truth is huh? gone, the truth is gone, and what hey, that means. What the hell were those yeah. numbers? Oh my gosh. Are I those... know there are codes in VLR that 
they give you and then you're just expected to know where they go and you're supposed to uh, like have them on hand like outside of the game they never give them to you again. Huh. no way what why are so you so i guess they started doing that in the second game Oh, is that you, Clover? I apologize for worrying you. Oh, Talison. You? Why? Junpei? And Seven? Is that you? Is everyone else there as well? Oh. <laughs> Jeez. You're, you're back! More, more Clover tears. My body's still a little weak. Oh, Big brother. You're back. You're back. You're really here. Bonnie oh, Chan. You're back. <laughs> Come now, what's gotten into you? It does give you a way to jump to the coast of the island. You're acting as though I've returned from the grave. I remember you could write them down in game. I did not remember that you could jump to the coast. Not just though. I just kept you them on did. like a. I really thought like, you were They dead. sent me a credit card offer, so I just used the back of the <laughs> I do like Snake. He is like uh, an anime version of Dead, uh, not Deadpool, of uh, Daredevil. I see. I believe I understand Deadpool. things rather well now. Thank you. For his healing capability. In the shower room, there is a dead body wearing my clothes. I mean, he took because several golden gun shots and just dead. kept going. That's correct. <laughs> Yeah. Like a lot you also of gunshots. A corpse in the captain's quarters, and Santa turned on you here, in this room. Thank you for reiterating everything that's happened. Got it. Do I have it straight? Well, the dead body in the captain's quarters is a surprise. Sorry, there wasn't a good time to tell you. Don't worry about it. Well, then. I've got a pretty decent idea of what happened while I was indisposed, but... It's still something of a mystery who did all this, and why. The corpse in the shower room that looked like me. And the corpse in the captain's quarters. Why were they killed in the way they were? You don't know? No. Why would I? The guy in the shower room. We don't know who he is, so let's just call him Mr. X. Anyway, this Mr. X is wearing Snake's clothes. Nothing about Snake is straight. Your yeah, kind of true. Rose. <laughs> He kind of has like a flamboyance I mean, to his uh, and put him on Mr. X. his cadence and tone. We need to figure out who that was. Ow. I apologize, but I have no idea who might have done this to me. I only just now woke up. I was unconscious during all the events you just described to me. And uh, I can't see... There's that. They must have undressed me and changed my clothes during that time. So if you want me to describe the person, I can't. When were you knocked out? <laughs> when we split up to I look forget, for the was red. Snake always blind, or did he lose his vision? Where did he they get you? loses you his remember? vision. Oh, okay. yeah. It was a small room in one of the hallways. I know he C lost deck. his arm in an accident, but I forgot what if that also... So, the same thing that happened blind. to every one of us when we were abducted. A canister releasing some sort of gas was thrown into the room. I believe the gas is some sort of incapacitating agent. 
Then that means it was... Zero. Looks that way, huh? There's nothing else I have to tell you. When I woke up, I was in this coffin. Hmm. Why? <laughs> Why did Zero make Mr. X wear Snake's clothes? How would that benefit Zero? I don't get it. What the hell does any of it mean? What does any of it mean? And I have no idea how morphogenic fields, obviously. <laughs> Oh, is this why he's like able to remember now? Is because of this telepathy truth bullshit. And truth had gone. <gasps> Where did those words come from? It's Gaia. Why did I feel compelled to push the buttons on the bracelet after hearing them? That line is hilarious if you get it wrong a couple times. Because <laughs> you're just like, uh, I just switch buttons. Let's be real. I guess that is the worst. And also, what kind of crap ass code is right, left, right, left, right, left? You figure if you have like buttons on a wristwatch. Your initial instinct is to just start hitting them the in right left succession, and like and the other is danger. Right? I mean and, and probably not three times. Yeah, but I mean if you threw in like a second left somewhere in there, then you just like make it somewhat not easy to just stumble into. <laughs> to be fair. Like, I, I completely agree with you, but also, to be fair, let's remember that the wristwatches are connected to bombs inside of them, and how much do you want to fuck around with it? <laughs> it's a numerical sequence? No, literally the code is right, left, right, left, right, left. Yeah. Like, you might as well just put all your passwords as one, two, three, four, five. Like... <laughs> Or While you're at it, passwords. There's a hidden secret in one four three eight three four two one. My birthday's in that number sequence. I'll let you guess. Zero. I would guess, but I think it's unfair. He's the ringleader, the person who trapped nine of us on this sinking ship. Zero should know everything. If we can uncover Zero's identity, all of our questions will be answered. Shouldn't we worry about getting off the ship first? Nah, we good. <laughs> no, time to go fight the power. <laughs> At any rate, we'll have plenty of time to decipher the details. Anytime I hear fight the power, now, it is of I can't help but think of uh, the office. There's like, like there's like one episode where the last time you checked the clock. I think it's like yes. Jim incites rebellion and he calls that his group means the we have less than an hour. And the whole the whole pitch we is must just hurry. like the best. Which for hey, some uh, reason how connects, are we gonna get out of connects to my mind. <laughs> Isn't that obvious? Through the other number nine door. Ah, uh, seven. Oh. oh yeah, yeah, you're right. Seven, you're really dumb. With Snake, we can open the door. I really wish Holder. we all agreed to just leave you behind. Don't tell me you hadn't figured that out. But no, Santa Come on, has you to gotta be a tell dick. Pull out a gun. I uh, assumed you'd figured it out. Yeah, yeah douche. It. Let's just get going. Ready to go? Let's go. Yes. 
Yep. God. Not yet. What? Huh? Before we go in, I'd like to check something. You want to check something. Wait, Seven's job doesn't require thought. He's a cop. Yeah, but before I do, Seven, could you pull the lever? I want to make sure we can verify with just the four of us. What do you mean? We don't need... Just do it, all right? But if the door opens, don't go in yet, okay? Do you want to get into that conversation? <laughs> no. Please, this is really important. Yeah, that's what I know. I really need to check this, okay? Work with me here. Fine. Four of us can go into door nine. So, I have knew that. Blood. It's obvious. Why are we doing this? Yeah, I don't. Obvious. Yeah, you're right. It is. I don't. Jim Pace yeah. is like, I'm a mole. I want to kill all of us. <laughs> what? Zero's bracelet? Assigned cop at birth. <laughs> A civilian trapped in a cop's no, body. I, I picked it up because I thought it might be useful sometime. <laughs> this was on the left hand of the corpse in the captain's quarters. Wait, how did we take it off the hand? Oh, it just fell off. Done. Yeah. <laughs> if you look at it, you can Super see dead. it's got a zero on the face. And even if he wasn't, there was a fire axe there. Just Ew. to make this a little easier to talk about, uh, I'm gonna call the guy we found dead. In Let's remember an axe house. ending. Cap. Let's remember why you bled out and died. Then I should be able to open door nine with just me, Clover, and his bracelet. Though the big question is, if he's oh, the best to <laughs> this game, would he really put one of these bracelets on? And zoned out for that. Yeah, true. Anyway, uh, let's just give it a shot. Clover, give me your hand. <laughs> Do we have the... Give me your hand. Uh, okay. Give me your hand. I have this axe here. Don't worry about it. Now the captain's bracing. <laughs> and pull the lever. I knew it. Now, what does this tell us? It has to be on your wrist in order for it to work. See, this is what I was wondering. Okay. No, that's impossible. Did you see how the panel showed a third asterisk when I scanned Cap's bracelet? <sighs> Whether or not it's on your wrist doesn't matter. All you have to do is put the bracelet near the panel for it to register. figure out what Cap's bracelet oh. was? Was that like six or something? You're right. I think you're right, yeah. See? So what does that mean? There's only one possibility. That bracelet isn't the number zero. It's a lie. It's a lie. Then what oh, you don't know that reference. No, I don't. All right, let's find out. Well, I can say what it's from without spoiling exactly what it was. Uh, it's from uh, Danganronpa V3. Mm. Okay, uh, so we're trying to figure out how to make nine with Cap's bracelet. Is that what it's asking? Scan the braces. Um, yeah, so we're trying to get to nine with Cap's bracelet. So if we're assuming it's six. Oh, I think it's six. Uh, then it's going to be... 
one and eight, so we're looking to make it eighteen. So six, uh, six and seven is thirteen. Clovers, uh, four. Seventeen. Uh, so that's this one. Let's try snake, clover, seven, and cap. If this combination opens the door, then cap's bracelet is number five. Oh, I fucked up. <laughs> I don't believe it's five. I think you're right. I think it's six. Yep. It didn't open. So it's not five. How about then? Uh, I mathed wrong. I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, so me and seven's twelve plus cap, which is six, is eighteen. June pay is one more than Clover, so it's whatever your previous answer was plus one. Uh, so it should be that one, in theory, right? Let's try snake. If this combination, no. Nope. I was wrong. <laughs> Oh, you have to go down one. It didn't open. To increase his bracelet. How about... <laughs> I thought it was worth it. It's literally like if there's a boss with math involved, I'm screwed. Um... So, seven in Junpei. So, seven and five. It's is... Twelve plus... Six is eighteen. That'd be it, right? Yes, yes, it was. Try seven, me, and figure it out. GG! The door the button's somewhere. I was gonna say, have you unpacked the GG button? It's in one of these boxes. What? Why? What does that mean? Plus, it's like. 1142, I don't want to piss off the neighbors. Isn't it obvious? Oh, yeah, how paper thin of the walls. bracelet is number six. It's been pretty thick. The only thing I can... But I've been able to hear is zero? a little banging upstairs around, like, this a dinner time. A what kind of thing? The symbol on here isn't it a Sounds like zero. people, like, walking around. Hmm. It's or, like, kids o. jumping around or something. I don't really know. Oh. Um, Whoa, and wait. then... I don't get my it. shower and my neighbor's shower well, are basically we out that cap's sharing a wall, is six, right? and both the handles squeak. So anytime that they take a shower, I hear it. Yeah. Does that mean there are two people with That's sixes? That's about it, though. It's been pretty quiet. There is most likely only one person so with a six. <sighs> but I don't get it. <sighs> what about June? Well, this is only an educated guess, but I think June's number was never six to begin with. So your walls are thick. Her bracelet thick was with like flipped. three C's. In other words, June's real number is nine. That seems the most likely. Wait, what? Then all this number door stuff was just a load of crap? Why would you say that? Hold on, what is going on? Because That's if fine. June is nine, then the numbers wouldn't match up. Are they assuming Here, June look. is not six? Yes. List of all the numbered doors June's gone through. I'll let you know what I'm writing, okay, Snake? Why not just assume there's two sets? And that's everything. Cause... I wrote down which door she went into and with whom. And I wrote what all the numbers were. Nine. So if you switch nine and wherever there's a six, the numbers don't work. If the digital root is seven, then you can't open door four. If the digital root is two, then you can't open door eight. Clover, do you notice anything interesting on that list? Is the blind guy about to mean? point out your math, your written You're math? You're talking about three, right? 
three. Santa's always in the room with her. That's what you're saying, isn't it? Yes, that's right. What about it? That's quite simple, really. How does the blind guy see this? You Hold told on. me that the first time you came to this room... <laughs> It's all Braille, don't worry about it. To leave June behind. <laughs> now, doesn't that beg the question why? Why would Santa do such a thing? The answer is easy. Because he's zero. Because Santa can't open door nine with only seven in Lotus. Of course, there's only one reason for that. His number isn't actually three. Santa's real number? Seven? Would you be so kind as to modify my sister's equations? Yeah, sure. This is what you were getting at, right, Snake? Hmm. Hmm. Thank you. That is exactly right, Seven. Oh, my God. Santa's true number wasn't three. It was Santa's zero. true number wasn't three, it was zero. No this seems Santa like a complicated theory. <laughs> and June was nine. Let's just start making up everyone's numbers. Okay, what was my one, number? Was zero, <laughs> Why is June nine? Plus three and minus three, they cancel one another. This is so stupid. <laughs> Are you serious with this? Okay, so then he. Santa was still playing by the rules of the Nunnery game this whole time. I feel like this is insane theory right now. Precisely. So you're saying Santa planned this whole thing? I'm not sure if he okay, acted alone so or not. Okay, let's, so let's just go through the sequence of events. I think it is safe to conclude that he... We had, uh, we found Snake, and everyone wanted to go through the number if 9 door. And June was like, hold up, let's figure out what number this bracelet is. So you do that. Turns out six. And then the next logical conclusion is to assume that Santa is zero. And, <laughs> and June is nine. June is nine for some reason. That would mean there are two number nine. Realistically, June could also be zero and Santa could be nine. If we're just going off this theory. I know, if we're basing this on nothing. Alright, that's realistically. Your number could be I or some Let's shit. Let's go. It's high time we <laughs> right? through that door. I don't get this whatsoever. Uh... Oh, it's right there. I love how we just all assumed that A, zero is playing by a specific oh. set of rules. All right, and B, let's that we going. figured those rules out. <laughs> I know, right? At some point, we just all were like, all right, we all agree, Santa's an asshole. Yep, okay, he's zero. <laughs> Santa pulled the gun. He must be zero. Hey, it's a... They all have made-up numbers. Hmm. This is the Neptune symbol. There must be a key around Snake can so obviously far. see the Neptune symbol. Why is he leading this expedition all of a sudden? I only have the Uranus key card. <gasps> okay, it's so the Neptune plan. symbol is carved in. So I'll, I'll give him the benefit of the doubt on this one. Let's turn around and but go back for you now. you make a good point on why is Snake leading yeah. this. <laughs> you know hey, what? Another door. Let's let the blind guy who's been locked in the coffin for the last Carver. four hours leave us. <laughs> He couldn't see his own it's capture happening. This is the place. He is now in charge of the group. <laughs> He's in some weird cult robes that a potentially mass murderer put him in. Kill deed. Hmm. Wow! It's totally full of books! Okay, I think... We're gonna just go ahead and call it right here.
because I have a feeling this is going to be another 20 to 30 minutes worth of dialogue about to happen. You are, let me see, hold up. You're in the puzzle room. Okay, perfect. So then this is where we're going to end it for tonight. So as per usual, thank you everyone for stopping by. It's been a lot of fun as always. It's good to be back. I love doing this. I'm not good at streaming anymore apparently, but I'm good at this. <laughs> so this is like all I want to do. <laughs> uh, so with that being said, uh, like I said at the at top of the stream, um, new time for this is just going to be one hour forward. So instead of 7 p.m., it's going to be 6 p.m. Pacific time. Uh, to help kind of compensate with Wolfie going to the wrong coast. Uh, <laughs> the wrong coast? That's exactly what I said. Those would be fighting words if I had a commitment to this place. You don't. Uh, <laughs> uh, for those of you that are new and like what you saw, please hit the follow button. If you're watching on the YouTubes, follow us on the Twitter and the Instagram. I'm at Lion87 on both. Or, just kidding. Uh... Whatever. Uh, or on Twitch. Uh, I'm Lino87. This is Wolf Freak with me. Hello. Uh, Wolfie, do you have any plans for streaming the rest of the week, or are you kind of laying low? I'm going to try to stream tomorrow. I have, I'm basically... Basically, tomorrow is finish unpacking, do a few more things for the apartment, like the move-in process, and then I'm going to try to stream... Uh, but before I do that, I basically have to rework my entire setup because we are definitely going to 720p, which is cool. Nice. Um, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, just keep an eye on Discord and Twitter. I'll post when I go live. Cool. Uh, the links are in the chat. The links will be up in the uh, description below. Uh, and that's going to do it for us tonight. Everyone have a good night. Good night.